How's it going? So today is not only my four month anniversary on YouTube, it is also the release date for the long awaited Shining Fate set. So what I'm going to be doing today is setting the benchmark score for the Shining Fates Pokemon Pack Challenge. You can check out the information for the Pokemon Pack Challenge in the description below, but it is basically an open pack challenge for anybody out there, whether you are a content creator or just somebody who has access to Shining Fates and a camera. It will run all the way until April the 2nd and overlap slightly with the Battle Styles Pokemon Pack Challenge, which will launch around the time of the release of Battle Styles on the 19th. You can find the scoring system and details on how to get involved down below. I'd really like to encourage as many people who can get the four Shining Fates booster packs to get involved as possible. This was a fun little community thing I put together so we can all enjoy being part of a big community pack battle. When you take part in the Pokemon Pack Challenge, you're not just pack battling me, you're pack battling every single other person who takes part in the challenge. So the more of you that take part, the bigger the battle. So I'm going to open up my Cramorant V tin. I've actually managed to secure one of every one of every product for Shining Fates. And for the very first time on the channel, there is a Shining Fates code. Get yourself a Cramorant V promo. And there it is, our Cramorant V. It's a little bit top heavy, but the edge looks fine. A lot of people have been complaining about damage to their cards, but that actually looks in pretty good nick. We're going to sleeve him up immediately. And that's my Cramorant V. So these tins do have five booster packs in them. I'm only going to be opening four booster packs in this video because this is for the Pokemon pack challenge. So let's see what we've got. Well, there you go. We've got two of these boys. So we'll move one of him away. Oh, I'm so excited for this. I've been looking forward to opening Shining Fates for ages and I wasn't even sure I was going to get my product today. Without further ado, let's crack on. For the first time, let's give it a little shake. Packets feel nice and sturdy. Very first card we are seeing from Shining Fates is a Grookey. I'm going to scoot away that code card. One, two, three, to the front. My chest is hurting, my heart is beating so much. We have a water energy. We are starting with, genuinely have to take a breath then. We are starting with Eldegoss, our boy Dartrix, Luxio, Grookey, a lovely Eevee card, Morpeko, Tootle, one of the Morpekos. Nick it. Oh, damn. A shiny Center Scorch V. I did not get any of the, sh of the Center Scorch V and V Maxes in Darkness of Blaze, and it makes me so happy that I've got a Center Scorch V. Wow. And our first rare is the Ugly Ditto. Damn. That is a fantastic first pack. Oh, this pack challenge is going to be fun. I lost the first pack challenge by quite a lot. The winners completely smashed my score. Hopefully this time you guys will struggle to smash my score as much. That is an amazing first packet of Shining Fates. All right, let's open our Dragapult packet. Give it a quick shake for good luck. I'm literally shaking. <laughs> I was not this excited for Champions Path. And we will scoot away the code card. Don't worry, I will be giving away those codes. You will see the secret code very soon. Second energy is Steel. And we are starting with Team Yell Towel, Tropius. I love Tropius. Gym Trainer, another Shinx. Horsey being adorable, Yanmar being a creepy bug. Again, more Peko. A very cute coffin who appears to be farting. A reverse hollow Eevee, and our second rare is a non hollow Zarude. That's a very cute Eevee card. All right, I'm actually going to save Charizard until last and open the Metal Bird Corvus Squire or Corvin Knight. I think. I think it's Corvin Knight. Oh, completely balked that packet. That's, that's ruined. Too excited, see. Way too excited. Hey, it's my boy Rowlet. Scoot away that code card. Can you tell I'm excited? You can tell I'm more excited than usual. One, two, three to the front. Our third energy is fire. And we have a rusted shield. 
the creepy serial killer clown ball guy, Floatzel, our boy Rowlet, Trap Inch, Snom, sitting on a bench, we have Grookey, we have Spinnerack, we have Coffin Fartin, we have... Oh, that was the reverse. The reverse hollows on the darks are very hard to see. And I was too excited. And then we have a rare boss's orders. So no points in those last two packets. I don't think we had any evolution lines and we didn't have any hollows. So last pack magic. What I'm going to do now, I'm not going to do a cutaway this time for this video. I'm just going to put the secret code up on the screen right now. If you send me that secret code, you will get one of the code cards from today's video. Send me that code on Instagram or Twitter and you'll get one of the codes from today's video. Let's jump straight back into the polls with our last pack magic. For my entry, the opening salvo in the Pokemon Shining Fates pack challenge, Charizard. Give it a quick shake. Oh. They are a bit more brittle, these packets, or they seem to be glued very heavily at the top, so it's a lot harder to split them in the way I usually do. Scoot away the fourth code card. One, two, three, to the front. Our last energy card is Psychic. And we are starting with Rotom doing some reading, Cramorant doing some surfing, another Rusted Shield, Horsey being adorable, our boy Rowlet again, the other Morpeko, Spinarak looking at some water, Snom sitting on a bench, a hey, shiny Appleton, nice. So that's two shiny vault cards we've had out of four packets. And our final rare for our first four Shining Fates packets is a hollow Luxray. So that's points for me, points for me, points for me. So guys, I know this is the entry video for the Pokemon pack challenge. So I should be keeping it on, on message. But this is also the first time I am filming a Shining Fates video. My stock literally just arrived. And I cannot wait to see everybody else's. Oh, bugger. That's going to make it harder for me. That's going to make it a lot harder for me. Okay, I'm just going to have to watch the video back and do my score. So that was 36. That's an extra two points. That brings me up to 38. Then we have a normal V ray which is worth three points. That is 41. Then we have the Appleton Hollow, which is worth three points. So that is 44. And then we have the Shiny Vault V, which is six, which I do believe brings me up to a total score of 50. I will check the tapes and make sure and put my final score up on the screen, but I'm pretty sure that brings me up to a total of 50. That was a crazy first video. Thanks for joining me. Please join in the Pokemon Pack Challenge for Shining Fates. It'll be a lot of fun. The more people we get, the more people you are battling. Thanks very much for watching. Hopefully you all get your stock as quick as I did. And if you don't, hopefully you get it within the next week. Thanks again for watching. Give it a like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Good luck with your polls. See ya.